what's up y'all okay welcome back to my channel okay so i just got out of my doctor's appointment well i didn't just get out of it i got out of it like 20 minutes ago 20 to like 30 minutes ago of my ob appointment with baby boy i weigh 118 so from the last time i was there last week oh i'm 36 weeks and three days by the way so when i was there when i was 35 weeks i was 112 no, I was 116. Yeah, I was 116 and today I'm 118. So, baby boy is, yeah, he is growing. Like, he's a big boy because I know what I mean. I'm a small person. I've always been tiny myself. So, I know what I mean. That is gaining this weight. It is sunshine. Okay, I know that. And also, don't mind my hair. I washed it and blow dried it um because i'm my maternity pictures is tomorrow so i'm doing like a quick weave on myself so i'm doing that tonight and then um but yeah i washed it and blow dried it it is a little sweated out so it's not like blow dried all the way out so i just have to re-blow dry it and then like later my mom's gonna um hot comb and like straighten it for me so that way it's all ready for me to do the quick weave on myself i went to my appointment and that's how much i weigh i weigh 118 um we listened to baby boy's heartbeat his heartbeat is perfect it's strong they you know he checked me to see if i'm dilated um still the same one and a half centimeters i'm still there my cervix he said is really really like really fucking soft so I was like, okay. And then he was like, yeah, your water might break before he even like gets here. Like, and we scheduled our C-section for it's three weeks away. So he was saying that my water might break before that, but fingers crossed that doesn't happen because I do not want him born in October. But if he is born in October, that's fine. I just hope it's not a Halloween baby. Like, I don't know because he could come at any minute. I'm 36 weeks, so and that's how long um, my OB wanted him to stay in. Just up at like once 36 weeks comes, like he could like he's okay for him to come out um, because of like our situation, my situation. So yeah, so I was like, what? My water might break like before the scheduled C-section. He was like, yeah. So that's gonna be funny if that does happen. I was like. Ooh, I want to experience that because I never ha like had my water just break on its own. It's always been broken for me. So that would be kind of cool if it did break. But, I don't know. What's wrong, baby? Oh, you were yawning. It sounded like she was crying, but that was just a yawn, y'all. You okay? Yeah. You sleepy? You want to take a nap? Want to go night night? yeah so we just dropped my sister off at school um my mom my sister's school is across the street from the mom so my mom went in there to go pee and then yeah i think after that we're gonna go home maybe i don't know but the next time you guys will see me is tomorrow because i have my high risk appointment tomorrow at 11 a.m and we get i get to see baby boy my mom's coming with me and we get to see how much he weighs that i'm i'm just super excited to see him like i haven't seen him it's been a month like last time i saw him was in september it's now october so yeah i'm excited to see him like my high-risk appointment is my maternity picture so you guys will be coming along for that for sure okay fresh eyes But yeah, so see y'all tomorrow. What's up, y'all? So I did my hair last night because I have pictures today. So hopefully everything goes as good.
we are on our way. We are on our way to my high rest appointment right now. I had to do my makeup off camera because we're running behind. Because of me and my mom. Not, not because of me. I was already done and waiting for like the last 15 minutes. Okay, it was me. I had to do my makeup. And yeah. So, we're going to see Sunset today. And you said you think he's going to weigh like five. Five? I five. Like five. Between five, one and five, five. So, five pounds in one ounce or five pounds in five ounces? Yeah, between there. Okay. I think he's gonna weigh like five pounds and 12 ounces. I don't know though. That'd be funny though if he's like six pounds already. I would, that would like, be funny because he's gonna be a big. Well, I mean, that's not big, honestly. It's big for me. Because you need an oil change. It's coming up again? Mm -hmm. uh. Yeah, so we're in a way. Um, it is cold outside. I'm glad because winter is here and summer is finally over, but like it's not because it'll cold. be back in the eighties soon. Mm -hmm. Promise you. You don't From what know the that. weather people say it's supposed to be eighty something in the next two days. So oh, dang. we only got some cold weather today. But we'll see. Mm -hmm. Enjoy it while we last. Sweats, cozy socks, sitting by the fire. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna see y'all when we get there. I made it to my appointment. I checked in. I was gotta wait to be called. We are three minutes late. But it's okay. We're fine with it. I just can't wait to see sunset. That's all I look forward to. To this appointment. Huh? So true. Yeah. I get emails all the time for them. Thirty six weeks, y'all. Thirty six weeks. I have two more. Jean was about to say yesterday. She's not delivered before her due date. Well, I was already delivering before my due date. My due date was 11 11. But I scheduled, they know, like, I scheduled my C section. It's in three weeks. That's all they know. Okay. But they don't know the exact date. But, yes, my OB was saying that he might come before the scheduled C section. Like, my water might break before that. And if that's the case, he might come in, in December. And I'm going to. I mean, not December, in October, right. and I'm a, I'm a cry because what if he comes on Halloween? I'm gonna put him back in. <laughs> Push him back in. I'm not coming. We're not, we're not doing a C session today. Mm -mm. I could not. His dad don't want him to come on ha on Halloween either. No, that's the one. He's not gonna come on on Halloween. He's not, but we're gonna see. I've never my water never broke on its own. I've always had it broken for me, so I don't know how that's gonna be. Okay, so we don't wait until we, the doctor comes. <laughs> Y'all. So we just saw sun sun. I can't record in here, so wait till we done. But look at little man. We got to see him swallow and oh stick my, out his that tongue. Was so cute. It was adorbs. Adorbs. Like adorable. I know what adorbs mean. When did you start saying that? Just now. Oh. <laughs> But, <laughs> but yeah, so everything looked good. He's good. There's still a bunch of fluid in there. I don't understand how he still got room, but because I'm a tiny person and it looks like he's just squished up in there. He probably is squished, but at the same time, he got room. So, but yeah, he was a lot of moving. So on the screen, it's I saw that it said that he was six pounds and four ounces. I was a pound, uh, a pound off. Yeah. 
So we're going to see when my doctor comes in to confirm it, if that really is his weight or not. Because if he's already six pounds, mom, I just had a feeling. I was like, he's in my head, I'm like, he's probably six pounds. But I was like, let me not. So I was saying five pounds and 12 ounces, giving him the benefit of the doubt. But that boy, yeah, he's going to be a big boy. How are you feeling? I'm just ready for him to come. I want to see him. I want to hold him. I want to smell him. Like, I'm just ready. Yeah. Y'all, okay, so he's a big boy. I keep saying that. That was a whole pound off. That's whole crazy. pound off. He is six pounds and five ounces. Boy, what are you doing in there? Gosh, everything else looks good. He is good. So that was my last appointment with them. And now I just have two more appointments left with my regular OB and he will be here. Just two more weeks for my all well, those appointments and then the third week he will be here. Unless he decides to come when he feel like it. Yeah. Hopefully it's after the 31st. Right? Because <laughs> we don't want no Halloween. No, no Halloween baby. No, no. Oh my god, okay. I'm glad to hear he's okay and he's doing good. Back to the house and then he's gonna come pick me up. So. So good i was so nervous i was like what if this is like an abandoned house like i found this person like so last minute on instagram and everything i was like i was a little nervous and skeptical I, I would recommend him i would go back i would have him take pictures of my kids like matter of fact i am like that's where we're going to take our pictures for sure i loved it baby loved it so we get our pictures back in two weeks. And I'm excited because I can't wait to see them. My child messed up the room. But anyway, so I'm gonna chill. I'm gonna take this dress off. And I'm gonna just relax, eat. I might order me some something from Little Caesars because I've been wanting something from Little Caesars for so long. So I'm gonna get it. My synthetic hair but I just needed something so like something quick and something like last minute for these pictures because ooh, it was just a lot going on it still is a lot going on right now so I just needed something so last minute and I hate that it doesn't blend as well like if I was to get human hair if I would have gotten human hair my hair would have blended so perfectly but it's not like you can totally see like where my in hair like kind of like stops at but i'm not mad at it it did what it did it did what it's supposed to like look at my belly um if anyone was wondering like i don't even know the brand name but it was it's a um 24 22 and 20 um, I originally wanted curly hair, but they literally was out of the curly hair and the packs that I did want was too much and I wasn't trying to have my mama spend that much. Like, we already have so much going on. Like, no. So, um, yeah, so I just ended up getting this and I was like, okay, I'm gonna just curl it. So I tried to have my mama curl it for me this morning but it literally would not curl. So I was like, yeah, this synthetic hair is good for like what you need it for like in the moment and then that's it like it this hair does not curl it's so straight which i love the straight hair don't get me wrong but i really wanted my hair to be curly for the pictures 
um i had even asked my best friend like my sister i was like sis like how should i have my hair like should it be straight curly middle part side part she was like side part and curly like mine so i'm like all right bet they didn't have nothing curly so that was not the fun thing about that but i feel cute but i am about to take this makeup off and i'm gonna just relax i do gotta pee Mm, I have a contraction right now. Whew, but yeah, so that is the end of this vlog. I You guys came with me to my high-risk appointment. You guys heard about Sunson. He's doing great. He is 6 pounds and 5 ounces. You know, he's breathing good. His heart is good. He has enough fluid in there still. Very active still. That's really good. So everything is good with him. Um, me... My cervix is really, 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 really soft. I'm already dilated, so they might, they my OB says that he thinks that um, my water might break and he might become, he might come before the scheduled C-section, which I'm hoping he doesn't because then he'll be born in October and I really don't want that. But he is literally chilling. His head is really, really low, like my OB said, like. Even my high risk doctor, they were like, yeah, he is extremely low. Um, but yeah, so he, he might come early. He might not. I don't know. But yeah. So I'm excited. I cannot wait to meet him. I have two more appointments with my regular OB. I'm done seeing my high risk doctor. I graduated from them. Like, I'm good, healthy wise. Baby is healthy. So I don't have to see them no more. Today was my last appointment with them. But with my regular OB, I have two more appointments and then C-section. Ooh. Not him pushing out, but yeah, so everything is all packed. I still need to do my hospital bag, which I need to do. But all right, y'all. So I'm going to let y'all go. Thank you guys for tuning in this video. I hope you guys give this video a thumbs up. And if you didn't, it's totally okay. Just thank you guys for watching.